like a newish colorway. I'm not 100% sure because I'm not a trainer pro. They're really cute. And do you know what? Right? I got these on Ego for $9.99. So literally like a tenner. And how cute are they? They just look cool. So it's like if you don't really care about, you know, what is it? Like fashion over beauty. No, pain over pain over beauty. Pain over um oh, whatever. They've been on plenty of nights out with me and <laughs> they've had all sorts over them. Um, what shape is that? It's like a square slash triangle. A square angle. Such a mum shoe. I'm not a mum, but it's such a mum shoe. Do you know what I mean? Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be my shoe collection. I'm going to show you my entire shoe collection and that is why I'm sat in the spot that I'm sat in right now because it's basically my wardrobe. <laughs> Behind me is my closet, here is all my shoes. So I thought it'd be a fun video to kind of show you guys my entire shoe collection. I have done two of these videos before but my shoe collection has grown um, or things have you know been swapped out. So I do have a few pairs of shoes on my Depop which I will link down below if you want to go and check those ones out. I've got like some Converse on there, some heels. Um, yeah so definitely go and check those out but today I'm going to be showing you all the ones that I have. So I have quite a lot, mainly heels um, but I also have a few like trainers and obviously like flat type shoes as well. So we'll jump in first of all with the trainers and then we'll do like boots, heels and then we'll go into sandals I think. So yeah if you do like the sound of this video then please do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and yeah let's start the video. The first pair of trainers I'm going to show you are probably my most worn trainers ever and it is my trusty Nike Air Force ones. These are the shadow ones so they're just a bit more, they've just got a bit more like detail and I think they're a bit more platform than the normal ones. They are in absolute dire shape. Um, they are so grotty and grubby and awful and I apologise for showing you them in this state but this is how you know that I've worn them so much. So I got these not the Christmas that is literally just gone, but the one before. And they look like that. So yeah, I haven't really kept them in the best shape because I just wear them all the time. But these are such a staple shoe. I honestly would recommend these trainers to anyone. I think they go with like any outfit. They make any outfit look really cool. And also if you're short like I am, because I'm five foot three, um, the little like platform just really, really helps, you know, add a little bit of height. And also with like trousers that are a bit long, the platform just helps them like not scrape along the ground <laughs> so yeah i really really love these shoes i'm thinking of buying another pair of these actually because to be honest they're not too expensive they're like just short of 100 pound which for a trainer i think is quite good um especially one that you wear all the time so i'm thinking of getting another pair of these in the same color like it's just white because these are not white anymore and i thought maybe i could have these ones for work and then like the nice new ones for like going out pleasure kind of thing you know not at work so i love the style of shoes so much that i picked up these ones so they're exactly the same shoes so they're the nike air force shadows but they're obviously just in a different colorway so they're kind of like a yellowy creamy color and then they've got like pastel purple on them pastel pink and then this bit's kind of like a suede mauve colour and then it's got like neon green at the front um these were a hundred pound exactly i think um but i just really really like them i just think they're really flipping cool and they're kind of like spring spring summery vibes but i actually did wear them today because they match my jumper with the like neon um so you can also wear them in the winter as well just if you want to be a bit colourful but yeah i really really like these i'm trying to keep these in a bit better condition than my other white ones um but yeah i really really like these i think in the summer as well they'll just look so nice and they also match really well with my prada bag because it's pink so i feel like yeah i just really really like them um so i'm definitely going to get another colorway of these but they're just so comfortable and yeah you can just wear them every day and they're just great <laughs> christmas just gone i actually have the box and i'm going to keep the box for these because i feel like that will make me keep them in better shape but for christmas just gone i got a pair of dunks so the ones that i got were these ones my boyfriend bought them for me very kindly um 
so I have actually only worn these once but they were really really comfortable so this is the colorway that I have mine in um, I think it's like a newish colorway I'm not a hundred percent sure because I'm not a trainer pro but I think my boyfriend mentioned that it was like a newish um, colorway so yeah could be wrong but I really really love them I think they're so cool and I can't wait to just style them up um so these ones are like a little bit different to the air force shadows so they're not like platform um they're quite flat but not like really flat so yeah they're really really comfortable i really like them um by the way i've got to say that i'm a size five and i've bought all my trainers in a size five and that's like perfect um and i really really like nike trainers i think that they're not too expensive but they just look really cool and they're really comfy um, and I've never had any problems with them um, but yeah they've even got like a pink sole which I just think is really really cool I just really like them um, and I think I'm going to get them in the black and the white as well like the panda um, colourway because I just think that will look good as well and probably will go with a bit more than these will um, but yeah I love the like pinky ready colour I don't know what colour that actually is but it's so nice um, they did also come with white laces as well so you can put like white laces in there but i definitely prefer the pink laces the next pair of like trainery sneaker kind of shoe um are just my classic converse so i feel like everyone and their nan has a pair of converse especially these black ones but i really really like them i think they're just a really cool shoe i when you put them on with an outfit i just think they automatically make it just look really like cool and effortless um but yeah these are just the low platformed ones like the original sort of high top ones um they're in pretty good condition to be honest because i don't wear them an awful lot um but i do need to just wash the laces because i feel like the laces get so dirty like so easily um i will say with converse they're not the most comfortable shoe ever because they they're quite flat so there's not a lot of like space between the floor and your shoe and sometimes they just make my like legs and my hips hurt because there's no like bounce to them do you know what I mean um if you've worn converse for a long time you'll sort of know what I mean but I still really, really like them nevertheless I just try not to wear them when I know I'm going to be like walking loads um but yeah they're just a really cool shoe and they do so many colors so many and I do actually need to buy some more because I feel like just having black is a bit boring. I need to like step up my game and get some nice like, I don't know. I don't know what colour, but I just want to get some. Um, I actually really do like the platform ones, but I don't know if I'd look a bit stupid in them. I'm not sure. I do really want them, so I might have a little look around and see. Um, but yeah, I think a Converse is just a classic shoe to get. And if you're looking to kind of get into your converse game which i'm pretty sure you probably already are um but if you want to like start it up then these ones are probably like the best ones to start with or maybe the low top i do find sometimes with the high top um they sort of like bag a little bit on your feet but maybe i've just got the wrong size no i've got them in a five i don't know um but yeah not the most comfy but just so cool Okay, going back to trainers, I'm going to show you these ones, which are really, really ugly, I know. But these are just my gym trainers. They're literally nothing special. They, I got them from like Sports Direct for like £45, like years ago. And I just haven't changed them. But um, I don't know, I just like them because they're so lightweight. So like when I'm at the gym, if I'm running, they're just really, really lightweight. They're really comfortable. I think they're called the Nike Flex. They're not the prettiest shoe, but they're just pretty basic and comfy and they're fine for the gym and then the next shoe is one that i used to wear all the time don't wear as much anymore they're just my adidas young ones so they're quite a chunky trainer um they're like suede so they definitely look a bit more beige than white <laughs> um but these are super comfortable um they're really lightweight as well and they've got quite a big like sole so yeah i think that's why they're so comfortable um i have worn these quite a lot but they're not in they're not horrendous condition to be honest um i don't really know what to say about these i bought these because a while back um chintzia from sophia and chintzia she got these and then she also got them in like the red colorway which i really really liked but i never got um 
but yeah i really like them i think they look really cool and because they're like a bit of an office white they look quite nice with like creams and stuff and they're just super duper comfortable okay so another classic shoe are vans so i have these slip-on vans these are just in black um they are the platform version as you can see so they've just got a bigger platform than like the normal ones um again i think i got these in a size five yep yeah, and they fit me perfectly fine i really really like these um i don't wear these ones as much as the other ones i'm about to show you and i don't really know why because they're black so i feel like they would go with literally everything but i don't know i just don't seem to wear them as much um but i do really like them and maybe my goal for this year is to wear these a bit more if not they need to go on my depot because i don't get as much wear out of them look they basically look brand new pretty much um but yeah these are just really comfy and just so easy to like slip your feet in and then i also have them in the checkerboard so they are also the platform ones um these are just super cool again well i went through a phase where i literally wore these every day pretty much like all the time and i haven't worn them in so long but I do need to wear them because I do think they look really really cool so I just need to find like a cool outfit to wear them with um I'm really like in a bit of a rut at the moment with like outfit ideas and stuff I just feel like my fashion inspo has just gone downhill so much and like I'm just really not feeling inspired um so yeah I need to just get back up on my game and find where to style these where it's just really cool <laughs> so if anyone has any ideas on how they wear theirs then let me know but yeah i really really like them i think they're just a really like jazzy shoe to have they remind me of chef shoes but i don't mind <laughs> i'm definitely not a chef okay so that's actually all the trainers that i have um so now i'm going to move on to boots which i only have well i have two pairs of boots but my first pair that i'm going to show you are my doc martins these are the Jaden boots um and these are the vegan leather ones so they're all like completely like matte black whereas if you get the um non-vegan leather ones the um stitching around this bit is yellow but on mine it's completely black <clears throat> also i'm really sorry if my voice is annoying you i have a bit of a sore throat so my voice is just really weird um but anyway they've still got the little yellow doc martin logo at the top but yeah i really love the Jaden boots i am short like i said to you earlier so these are just really handy for me to have because they give me a bit of height um so i actually did get oh i did get them in a size five for some reason i thought i got them in a four because everyone was telling me to size down but i have got them in a five okay well that changes things because i was going to say to you to size down but don't because mine fit me perfectly if anything i probably could have gone a size up and got a six but i don't know yeah i am a bit confused because sometimes when i wear these they really hurt my toes so i don't know if it's because my toes are cramped or if my feet are just too wide for the boot <laughs> um but either way they're just really cool not the most comfiest things ever like they're quite a heavy shoe and i don't know yeah I, I like i wore them to a festival like all weekend and my feet were in bits afterwards so yeah but they just look cool so it's like if you don't really care about you know what is it like fashion over beauty no pain over pain over beauty pain over um oh, whatever i don't know but yeah just a classic really really cool make any outfit just go from like zero to 10 <laughs> zero to 100 um and i really like them and i feel like as well do you know what these are a really good shoe idea if you don't wear heels if you're not into wearing heels or you know you, you've got an outfit on that you just don't have any heels to match it i think doc martin boots you can definitely still wear on like a night out and they it still makes your outfit look dressy it doesn't always dress them down just because they're flat i just feel like yeah if you're not in the mood to wear a heel or you're with like friends who aren't wearing heels but you you're like i haven't got any nice shoes my outfit's gonna look crap throw on a pair of these and i feel like it doesn't it really doesn't it just looks cool it just looks cool um i did used to have a pair of doc martens that were like the low like
like just like the shoe version um i can't remember what they're called now but i sold them because i went through a phase where i did wear them all the time but then i just kind of didn't wear them for like ages and they're like quite a bit of money just to have sitting around so i sold them on my depot but yeah the jaden boots i can't see me selling ever <laughs> ever Okay, and then the last pair of boots are a heel boot. So they're just these ones, which I actually got from TK Maxx. Um, I'm not sure what the original brand of them is, but I know that's really not helpful because I can't link them. But I'll try and find some similar ones because they really remind me of the Topshop boots. Um, I can't remember what they were called, like the Hurricane boots maybe or something. But yeah, they remind me of them. But I know they also do these on like Nasty Gal. So I'll try and link some similar ones down below. But they're just like a croc print patent boot. Um, square toe, which is just really nice. And like a block heel. So really good for the winter time. Um, just a really cool shoe. I, do you know what? I haven't actually worn them yet. I haven't worn them yet and you're probably gonna hear that a lot going forward because i've got a lot of heels which i've not worn yet because they're new but i will i will wear them i will um <laughs> i will i'm trying to convince just me as well as you um i actually got these in a size six because they were the only ones available but i actually think because of the square toe it's probably better to size up anyway in these because you know it cuts quite a bit of the shoe off so really there are five um or just wear like a thick sock with them but yeah i think these are really cool and really good for the winter time um for like nights out and things and just having a block heel is just so comfy but they just look really cool and classy so yeah i just need to figure out what to sort of wear these with um because they're like a bit of an awkward height so some things they just look a bit weird with so i'm just yeah i just that's my aim is to just find what to wear these with but i just think they're really cool and a heeled boot you can never go wrong with as well so i'm going to jump into heels in a second but i have this pair of shoes which just fall into the flat category i guess um these are new and they're from shein so they're just these little like painting loafer shoes um with like a gold detailing here and a, quite a big platform so they're really light <laughs> um i got these in a size five i could have sized up but that's fine um just a thicker sock is good but yeah these are a really good shoe as well for like making an outfit a bit dressier but also not like wearing a heel um and they have got like a bit of a heel on them they're quite platformed so you know me i like that um but yeah i just think they're really cool and they're quite preppy as well so i feel like you can make a little cute outfit with these i'm thinking like an oversized jumper dress with some tights and knees or like a shirt dress with um what do you call it what are they called sweater vest i'm um, just like a really preppy like cute look <laughs> Okay, so let's jump into heels. I have quite a few, but I'm gonna start with like, sort of like, I'm gonna go from like favorite to least favorite, I think, just cause I feel like that'd be more fun. <laughs> okay, so I haven't worn these ones yet just because I haven't had the opportunity to. Um, and they're definitely an acquired taste. They're from Ego. And they're these. So, like I said, definitely an acquired taste but I flipping love them. So they look majorly high, they look really high, but they're not really because this fits like a platform um, and they're just like a little knot on the front. They're really cute. And do you know what, right? I got these on Ego for 9.99. So literally like a tenner. And how cute are they? Really cute. This kind of style of shoe is so in at the moment as well um, with like the big platform. And yeah, I just think they're really, really pretty. And they're pink, so they match my Prada bag. And that was so, quite, uh, that was kind of the reason why I bought them. Because I was like, oh my god, they're pink. They're going to match my Prada bag. So when I go like out... Yeah, uh, anyway. I really, really like them. I just think they're so statement. And just really cool. And in like the summertime, I feel like these are going to be like my go-to shoe. They're probably not going to be the most comfortable. Um, but who cares if you look good um but the heel is not like a stiletto so it's got a bit of like sturdiness there so yeah i'm really excited to style these up i just think they'll look really nice um definitely with like jeans or something i think jeans will be better with these because there's no like strap maybe a dress but i don't know whether it'd look a bit weird i'm not sure but yeah really cute really pretty 9.99 bargain 
and then I have these ones which were a little um, TK Maxx find an absolute steal so they're these um, again such an acquired taste I'm going to be saying that about everything but they're just these little heels so they're like this so like you put your toe in and then they kind of like strap around your foot really really cute um, they're like a mermaidy um, they're like it looks like yeah a mermaid tail basically but in a shoe version and uh, I know that not everyone will like these but I honestly just think they're so pretty and really cool oops <laughs> hit myself in the face and like in the summertime with like a really cute little like nice dress with these on like glowy skin ugh, on holiday or something these are just so nice and what I like about it is the heels not actually like that high so they're quite a good height of heel um so these like I said were from TK Maxx and they're from a brand called Carvella um so it said that they were like they retailed at like 200 pound or something um and I got them for like, I think they were 16.99. Like literally an absolute bargain. Um, oh no, I was, I was being dramatic. They were 99 pound and I got them for 16.99. Um, there's me exaggerating the truth. But yeah, I still think that's amazing and I just love them so much and I can't wait to wear them. So yeah. I then have these ones from H&M. Sorry, they're a little bit dusty. <laughs> Um, they're just these so it's really hard to kind of show you but they're just they're sort of like a flip-flop heel so they've got straps on the foot um what they've got straps by like the toe so your toe goes like in like that and they strap over and then this strap like wraps around your leg and it's not quite a kitten heel but it's not like a massive heel so I feel like it's good it's nice because if it was a kitten heel it'd be an absolute no-no because I just don't like them sorry not sorry um but yeah I think this heel is like a really good height um really good for like a daytime shoe as well if you're just like going for brunch but you want to be a bit more dressy um and I love the square toe of them I love a square toe um you'll probably see a common theme throughout the rest of my shoes because they're pretty much all square toe um but I actually got these in a size six which I've only just noticed now um, but I've worn them plenty of times and they fit me fine so yeah um, but I really like the lilacness of them again just really good for the spring summer time as well and for like bottomless brunches things like that I just love wearing a little mule <laughs> um, but these ones are really really cute I don't know if they'll still be on the website but I will try and link any well every one of these shoes down below and if not then I will find the closest dupe that I can so please do check the description box if you do want to find some shoes similar to this because I know a lot of these shoes are old and there's nothing worse than when you watch a video and you're like oh I love that but then you can't find it and you're like oh great thanks so I will try and find you a similar if not exact shoe next up I have these ones from hey no uh P PLT I really can't talk today can I my brain is not with it um yeah they're from PLT so they're just like a little mule again um kind of a square toe kind of not and this bit is like elastic bands it kind of looks like hair bands on your shoe but I really like it I've on they look really cool um off not so much but yeah I really really like these and you can kind of like put them closer together or spread them out a bit more however you want to wear it you can sort of do um but my favorite thing about these is that the heel is not too high but it's one of those ones that has like the what shape is that it's like a square slash triangle a square angle um, I don't know but yeah I really like that because I feel like it just makes the shoe feel so much more sturdy and they're just really cool and you can't go wrong with a black heel but these ones are a bit spicy because they're a bit like different compared to just a plain strappy heel um, I got them in a size 5 and they fit perfect and I just really really like these ones they're just a staple they just kind of go with anything because they're black this next pair of heels um, again mules again square toe <laughs> Um, I love these shoes. I think they're so cool. I love the colour of them. So, they're a square toe mule, but can you see they're kind of like quilted? So, this bit's actually like padded, and the heel is not too high, but, 
you know, it's a good size. It is a stiletto one, but these shoes are honestly so comfortable. They're really gripped. Can you see the bottom? They're like really gripped and I just think they're so comfortable. Honestly, really comfortable. These are from Shein and I am going to put it out there right now that Shein heels are the most comfortable heels ever. I said it. I said it. Mm-hmm. Oh, she went there. But yeah, uh, they honestly are. And these ones are so nice. I love them. I love a statement shoe. I love the green. I just really like them. And I don't really want to keep sitting here saying that about every single shoe that I own. Because I obviously like them because I own them. Do you know what I mean? But these ones are really, really good. And I bet you they're still on the website. I think they may have had other colours as well. But this was my fave. But I do want to get... I want to get a pair of shoes like this, but in like a cobalt blue, because I don't have a blue pair of heels, so that's next on my list. Excuse the state of these ones, you know, they've been on plenty of nights out with me, and <laughs> they've had all sorts over them. Um, spillages, drinks, sick, whatever, you name it, they've been on these white shoes. So that's really nice. I have cleaned them, but, you know, there's only so much cleaning a girl can do. Um, so they're pretty similar to the white one, um, the green ones to be honest. They're just like a square toe heel and these ones, it's like quilted. Um, yeah, pretty much the same as the green, but not. <laughs> same, same, but different. Um, these are from Shein as well. And again, just super comfy. And my friends have borrowed these. You know, I've worn these and this bit's like squishy and padded and we've all commented on how comfy they are. So yeah, they're a really comfy shoe. Obviously a white heel is a little bit risky because they get so dirty, but um, comes with the territory, doesn't it? What's that, Chloe? Another Shein heel? Yes. <laughs> yes, it is. It's another Shein heel. So these are just some really cute ones. Um, <laughs> right. Up. What is happening? So, oh my god, the dust is getting everywhere. It's so itchy on my nose. It looks like I'm picking my nose, but I'm not. It's just itchy from the dust. Okay. So, they're just these like leopard print heels, which have some like cream straps over the foot, which look really cool. Um, the leopardy print is like suede. They're not typically something that I would go for, and they do look a lot better on as well. Um, but they're just, they're really cool. They like spice up a little outfit, um, and they're super comfy. And I've just remembered that my boyfriend's dog got a hold of this shoe. So I've got some little bite marks in there. Thanks a lot, Phil. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, I really, really like these shoes. Again, they're like padded, and they're just cool. They're just cool. I have had these next heels for ages. Um, they're from Topshop and they're just these little like snake print heels. Um, so the heel is sort of like, I don't know how to describe it. It's kind of like thin, but it's like rectangular. I don't know, it's just quite cool. Um, and yeah, they're just a single strap and they've got this little strap around the ankle and they're really, really comfortable and they're just, I just think they're quite statement as well. You can wear like a nice little outfit with them. Nice and statement and cute. Um, don't really know what to say about them. So I have these clear Perspex heels. These ones are from In The Style, I believe. I think they were the Sophia and Chintzia range um, back in the day. So yeah, they're just like a Perspex heel strap with um, the same sort of, what do you call it, bottom as the other one. Um, so yeah, that's really cool. They're really comfortable. Apart from this bit, it's very tight on my feet. I have got quite wide feet, but yeah, I wish I sort of went up a size in these ones. So I'll probably try and find some more um, another time, which are the same shoe, but like I can go up a size because they're just a little bit tight. But um, I don't know whether that would change or if that's just my fat feet. <laughs> um, but these are such a good shoe to have because all the, they go with any outfit. Where they're um, clear, you could just put them on with any outfit and like they go with it. So you've not got to worry about buying like loads and loads of shoes because you have these ones which go with sort of any outfit. If that makes 
sense although that didn't stop me from buying loads and loads of shoes <laughs> um but yeah just a really good one to have and you can also get types of shoes like these that are lower heeled which you can wear like day and night so that's just really handy as well um to go with any outfit okay i'm gonna try and speed this along because i feel like it's getting a bit boring um but i just have these little shein heels they're just little black ones um they did actually have like a metal chain going around them but it snapped off so i just like cut it but i kind of just prefer that they're just a plain black shoe and they're like a really good height as well so they're just so comfy you can wear these out for like dinner and things like that where you don't want to be like too dressed up but you do want a little heel um, and just a classic black mule is just a statement really and just very not a statement a staple and just very handy to have these shoes i got from h&m and they're just a really cute little like cork bottom zebra print shoe i just thought that on holiday these are just dreamy like how cute and not high at all so again like going up for a meal just a really good shoe to have a statement shoe because of the print um, I really really like them. I got them in a size 4 actually and they fit me perfectly fine but I just think they're such a nice cool shoe and a little bit different to like what you see everywhere else um, and like I said on holiday they're just dreamy or just like in the summer um, and you can definitely wear these in the daytime as well like day to night and super comfortable. So next up I have these little orange mules. These are just a really cute little low heel sort of like everyday wear um and they're kind of like a flip-flop version again so your toe goes like in there um and like straps around it sort of thing just really pretty a really good block heel so comfy um and i love like the orange color they had these in other colors too which are really really nice as well um but i just picked up the orange because i had like a little orange um, bodysuit I think that I was gonna wear with these um, but yeah I just really really like them and I like the fact that I've got like a mixture of heels that are high some that are like medium length medium height even um, so yeah that just makes them really comfy and like you can wear them a bit more because you can just wear them out for like little lunches and stuff like that is definitely fine for like a daytime lunch um, or like going out for dinner or something so yeah I just love I'm like obsessed with heels I don't know if you can tell and I just like to have all different colors and just a lot of variety basically and Shein are the perfect place to buy shoes like that because they have so 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 many on there so I will link these and all the other colors as well got two more pairs of heels left and then we'll move on to sandals so these two are very similar to be honest um these ones i've had for years from primark they're just like a pink suede um mule and yeah i've had them honestly for so 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 long but i always keep them because they're just a really nice staple to have um and like super comfy and again like you can wear these in the day as well um really really like these ones and then i have a really similar pair like i said these ones are from h&m so they're just a mule again with like a block heel um these are a bit more like 70s vibe um but super comfy i have got quite wide feet like i mentioned earlier so like it's a bit tight on my foot but just <laughs> i squeeze it in there and i'm just hoping that over time it will like stretch out a little bit and they'll become even more comfier than what they are um but yeah i really really like these i just like the cream color as well because i feel like they just go with like a lot of things and it's just nice and neutral so yeah that is all of my heels and then we're going to move into like sandals now but please bear with me i know this video is super long so i'm going to try not to ramble but i just want to you know i want to show you guys so i keep all my sandals in this little basket that i got from um b m or the range or somewhere um so yeah it's just a bit handy just to keep them all in there keep them all together especially at the moment because obviously i'm not wearing them so the first two pairs of shoes is some yeezy slides dupes <laughs> they're dupes um so i just got them in like the yellowy cream pair and the blue um unfortunately i accidentally got them both in a size four and i'm definitely a size five because they don't they fit but like my foot is like right on the edge so i definitely could have gone for a five um but you live and you learn um but they're super duper 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 comfortable 
affordable but they're like a fraction of the price of the real Yeezy slides so yeah I feel like you can't really tell the difference either these ones are the ones from Ego and I just honestly think they're like they're basically the same um so comfy and just really nice to just chuck on and run to the shop or whatever um so then next up i have these little sandals which i completely i'm literally in love with them they're from h&m um and they had them in a black and just like a beigey like normal like rope color as well but i went for the orange because obviously i like to just anything that's like orange or bright i'm there um these are just a, such a good shoe to wear on holiday like how cute are they with just like a nice pretty like dress i just think they're really nice um but they are a bit tight so you've got to definitely stretch them out a bit but yeah they're really nice they might still be on the website i'm not sure or they might come back in like next year but yeah such a cute shoe i love i love them i just think they're really cool they're like just rope but they're a shoe you know it's great um what else have we got in this little goodie bag i've actually forgotten because oh I, I want to show you these but I also don't they're just horrendous they look so gross <coughs> um but right, I'm going to show you them but you cannot judge me for the state of them please 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 they're my Birkenstocks <laughs> oh they're so dirty dirty um so anyway yeah they're my Birkenstocks and they're in like the brownie colour um, with like a bronze buckle, super comfy, such a mum shoe. I'm not a mum but they're such a mum shoe, do you know what I mean? Um, it's like a mum shoe but make it cool. I don't know if I make it cool but they're just comfy and they're just, they're you know, they're, they are what they are. Anyway, love about them. Some more shoes from Shein. Uh, sandals, super comfy. Wore these all summer. So if you have watched my channel, you probably saw every outfit I had these on. Um, when I went to Morocco, I took about five pairs of shoes. Basically wore these the whole time. So that's fun. But yeah, they're just spongy. Just so spongy and just so comfortable. So comfortable. And same with these ones. They're also Shein. Basically the same, but different. Super comfortable, super spongy love them so much these two pairs of shoes are the same from Shein shock not sponsored by Shein wish I was but I'm not <laughs> so Shein hello come find me um square toe little shoe problem is they're so flat that they're very uncomfortable because your foot is so flat to the floor but if you just pop them on on holiday to like walk around the pool or go for dinner or whatever they're absolutely fine you don't need anything too spongy and comfortable um then i have these shoes from primark which is just a little like buckle shoe not my favorite things ever I, i've kept them just because but to be honest they'll probably end up on my depop soon um and then literally so boring just some white javian flip-flops bought these at the airport going to morocco so comfortable <laughs> such a staple and then i have my little calvin klein sliders so that's sort of my sandal collection i just thought i'd rush through that because we've been we've got so many shoes going on that it's a bit boring for you to just sit here and listen to me ramble about all of them um but yeah <laughs> i hope that you did enjoy this video um i'm really nosy and i was like seeing other people's like shoes and stuff so i just thought maybe you would if not that's fine you've probably not made it this far anyway if you have chufty badge to you please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already um let me know any video ideas you want to see down below in the comment section and i shall see you in my next video <laughs> bye guys